people ask me what kind of dog I have, I say Pembroke Welsh Corgi, and they kind of look at you, and I'll say, you know the pictures of the queen with her dogs? And they go, oh yes, and then they know instantly what it is. Welcome to Meet the Breeds, the dog show where it's not only the animals vying for the judges' attention. Anyone who knows dog show people, we're all crazy. So if you ever want to give us some help, just let us know who a good psychiatrist is. The event at Pier 92 in New York is organized by the Westminster Kennel Club and the American Kennel Club and gives attendees the chance to meet more than a hundred different breeds. But what sets this apart from other dog shows is the effort the owners put in themselves, dressing up and decorating their stands to complement their prized pets. Oh, the pageantry of this event I think is very special for people to come out, not only to learn about the breeds to see if there's one that's right for them, but also because every breed comes from a specific place and it helps kids, adults, learn about culture, geography, um, really all sorts of aspects of people in the world. But it's also an opportunity for their devoted owners to champion their dogs of choice. We always say that the Mastiffs are the keeper of the castle. They're an old English breed and originally they were bred to watch the house. We have three Mastiffs who go through a 40 pound bag of food every 10 days. People always freak out. They probably haven't seen a dog this big ever. Peter Pan's Nana was a Newfoundland, so they're natural nursemaids, fabulous with children. I like their athleticism and their companionship. They're good companion dogs. This year's event attracted tens of thousands of curious dog lovers and was part of a three-day program of competitions and shows. As always, the bar was high for both pets and owners. This is the sixth year of Meet the Breed, so every year everybody has to go up a notch, so you're going to come across that. The AKC has a competition for what they think is the best booth, so every year we try to up the ante and do something a little bit different so that we attract the attention of the public, because the Saluki has a great story. And although the dogs seem to enjoy themselves, they aren't the only ones fond of the attention. I really enjoy it. I enjoy it. You get to be a different persona. I can just sit and wave, talk to people, be with the corgis. It's a wonderful day. I enjoy doing it. Oh, these are definitely eccentric people. I don't go to dinner like this. <laughs> but I love to dress up. <laughs> and I love to dress my dogs up too. Um, I think dog people in general are eccentric, but they're very passionate about what they do and what they breed and what type of dog that they own. They're really heart dogs. The focus really is the dogs, but hell, we're here, it's part of us too. 